हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो बेसिकली बहुत सारे बच्चों की डिमांड यही थी कि सर बोर्ड्स और यूजीडब्ल्यू दोनों चीजों को कैसे साइमल्टेनियसली मैनेज करें किसको ज्यादा प्रेफरेंस देना चाहिए हाउ मच टाइम वी शुड डिवोट टू द बोर्ड्स एंड हाउ मच वी शुड फोकस ऑन टू द री सिलेबस ऑफ यूजीडब्ल्यू एग्जाम सो इन दिस वीडियो विल बी लुकिंग टूड ऑल दो थिंग्स इन डिटेल राइट सो लेट स्टार्ट विद दीडियो so here is uh, a little ppt that we had for uh, the discussion so here is the books jo ki like you can get so teen books ka agar aap triple id prep ki website se lete ho to you get a discount and uh, like if you wish single so you can also get it so within 4 days you get the delivery now let's to talk directly to the point like what the thing is so the thing is jo jo aapka board ka syllabus hai go through the syllabus for the examination what this says is jo aapka board ka syllabus hai it is equally important Why? Because जो यूजीडब्ल्यू में एस यू पी आर का सेक्शन होता है इन इन एसयू पी आर सेक्शन यू हैव इज योर इलेवन ट्वेल्थ फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री मैथ्स का सिलेबस राइट सो योर फिजिक्स एंड बेसिकली केमिस्ट्री का जो आप प्रिपरेशन करोगे फॉर योर बोर्ड एग्जाम इज गोइंग टू हेल्प यू इन द यूजीडब्ल्यू एग्जाम टू बिकॉज एस यू पी आर इज यूज फॉर शॉर्ट लिस्टिंग बेसिकली राइट इट्स अ फिल्टरिंग स्कोर बट स्टिल यू नीड टू क्वालिफाई दैट स्कोर लास्ट ईयर इट वॉज ट्वेंटी टू सो आउट ऑफ फिफ्टी इन एस यू पी आर यू नीड टू स्कोर ट्वेंटी टू राइट सो बेसिकली दिस इज वॉट इज द थिंग सो कवर द सिलेबस राइट इलेवन ट्वेल्थ का सिलेबस कवर करना है नाउ वॉट दिस मीन्स अगर सिलेबस कवर करना ही है राइट एंड इफ यू हैव योर बोर्ड एग्जाम विथ यू अलॉन्ग विथ योर यूजी डब्ल्यू एग्जाम बट यू नो यूजी डब्ल्यू एग्जाम आपको लाइक इट्स ऑन फोर्थ ऑफ मे सो यू हैव अ गुड अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम टू पुट इन एफर्ट्स फॉर द बोर्ड एंड देन you can dedicated your time towards the ugwl exam so if your board is there right and if your syllabus is not then covered then you should not think about the ugwl exam instead of that what you should do is you should focus squarely on to your like boards exam because at the end currently jo aapki boards exam chal rahi hai wo to usme aapko help hogi hogi apart from that whenever you were like ugwl exam is going to be happen that is on 4th of may at that time also you will see the benefit out of it right so basically this is all is the thing so focus on ugw and je first so basically this is what is the thing at last you know boards is important but it's not highly important ki you are skipping the preparation of your ugw and je completely right you can give some mocks right or you can solve some pyqs because you know board scores are considered uh, neither at a like not even at a single place you will find that board scores are considered so your j score and ugw scores matters a lot but still boards are important because why the syllabus is same right the syllabus is same that's why boards are important but that doesn't means you need to completely ignore the ugw and jw simultaneously you can do now what this simultaneously means is let's suppose on the weekend you have a uh, one hour of time so in a day you can take out one hour at least right you can attempt the re questions or let's suppose for g you can attempt the g pyq so that's what is the thing that you can do now the next or thing is like how to plan for both the exam so make a detailed plan and set target this is general right a lot time for the practice question daily right in the ugw exam now what this thing basically means is in g you have like what are the question you have in comparison with g in ugw you have very high number of questions right and the time is restricted so in sapi section you have one hour in that you need to crack around 50 questions so this is something for this you need the speed right and speed will be achieved with the help of practice only practice basically means with mock so at exam.tripleitprep.com you will register even though those students who are already enrolled in course they will get the access so at exam.tripleitprep.com the mocks are there so those are already released you can start preparation from that this doesn't mean you need to completely skip your boards and directly focus on to your ugwe and the g right it's not like that your first boards is there right so you should put in the efforts for the board but yeah of course sare bachcho ke sath hoga hi because unhone 11 12 ka syllabus pura complete kar liya uske baad unhone je first attempt ke liye padha hai now again they are repeating the same thing for the board exam jo is ki difficulty lag bahut matlab less level ki hoti hai and they know ki iska score zyada matter nahi karta hai so of course mentality tendency nahi hoti hoti hai bachche ki padhne ki like it is there but till up to certain extent bachcha bore ho jata hai so what they should like try to do is jo bhi unke paas spare time mil raha hai in that spare time they should or they can focus on some other topic jaise maan lo pure din mein agar 1 ghanta bhi nikal lete hain you are able to solve few read questions Or few G P Y Qs, those are also more than enough, right? So this is what is the thing. 
that you can do then remember to revise a uh, revise and all those things are basically this is the basic fundamental wo to aapko karna hi padega there is no option and that's the thing then the next thing is set daily target this is what we said so like on the weekly basis on the daily basis daily basis agar aap itna bhi karte ho ki half an hour i will solve some questions it's not like course is there right a usually crash course is there all the lectures that you will be provided to you you will be having the access of it the recording access will be till your date of exam so you don't need to worry regarding all those things just the only factor is right now whatever the time you are getting let's like, say you are getting half an hour you are not able to complete any video lecture what you can do you just try to solve some question right some try to solve some read question those are logical based question and after that whenever you will get time let's suppose after board is exam till the ugw exam you have good amount of time in that you can cover the ugw lectures right those are basically a bit of tougher side those lectures you can cover in the, that period and rest the whatever the lectures which are bit easier you can cover within your board preparation right just the thing is give less time prioritize the boards and give the ugw a bit of lesser time so basically this is the thing get the basics right basics is basically means your board syllabus right if your board syllabus is well and good then you will not face a problem in your supi section once supi section is cleared we are there for reap section right the crash course is completely dedicated on to the reap you will never face a single problem on to the reap section right so that will be taken care of yes you don't need to worry but yeah basics need to be clear basics mean what is physics chemistry math basic fundamentals need to be clear because in reap also there will be few question which will be having Uh, which will basically require a base or foundation of your physics concept or maths concept so those questions are also coming over there so you need to be prepared for that so get the basic right and how you will make the basic right is by preparing your boards preparation so whatever the preparation you are doing for board make it sincerely right with the good efforts and yeah you will see the results out of it then the next thing is Importance of practice. That's what is the basic thing that you all know. There is nothing to say about it. The more practice you will do, the better. Score the better rank you will get, right? That's what is the thing. Keep yourself motivated and avoid distraction. This is something which has been repeatedly, constantly hammering you always, right? So you need to be focused on whatever the goals that you have because remember you have given two years of uh, your like time for your preparation for JNR, and within these last two months, if there is something which might spoil uh, or which might affect your end result or end goal, then I think. it's your personal mentality right it's your personal alarm that you should be having that hey i need to take a pause here i need to focus on the studies i need to focus on my goals on the things that i want to achieve in my life so this is basically the thing that you can do and that's it the conclusion is quite simple your score and ugw and ge will be going to decide your future dedicate yourself to prepare well for this exam and on the last month focus on the boards with the strategy you will now this is not a thing at all right so you know like boards are already there right so what the thing that you all should do is boards is there right prioritize board once the board is done let's suppose you have maths paper you are done with it you are done with a good amount of preparation then instead of wasting your time here and there what you can do is you can take some dpps out of the crash course so in crash course every topic is two dpps you can take at least one dpp i can solve those one dpp so it's going to benefit you in the long term that's what is the thing but this doesn't mean you need to completely ignore the boards boards is your first priority at the end of the day while preparing for the boards you get some time try to solve some questions of ugw or jd it for today and yeah there is a crash course those who haven't enrolled they can enroll the lectures access will be available till the ugw final exam like that's on 4th of may so let's suppose if you are not getting time right now what you can do is just take a pause let the, your boards be finished and after boards you can start with the lectures and all so in the crash course mock test combo you get both the course 
and the mock test series it's a combo pack so that's what is the thing so if you have any doubts or if you want any video on dedicated topics just comment down on this video we'll make sure that those videos are available for you and that's it have a great day take care bye